Welcome to the 10 Minutes Travel Channel, where we discuss various topics concerning travel, recreation, and suggestions for your upcoming expedition. In this video, we will accompany you on a tour of Belize, located in Central America, and elaborate on why it deserves to be one of your top picks for a vacation destination. Belize is a destination that is abundant with natural beauty. Apart from having the world's second largest barrier reef, the place is also home to dense jungles that host howler monkeys and jaguars, mountain pine forests, palm-surrounded beaches, bonefish flats, rivers, caves, and coral atolls bordered by fish-rich reefs. It is an ideal destination for eco-tourists. Besides nature, there are other attractions that lure tourists to Belize. The country is dotted with intriguing ancient sites like Lamanai Archaeological Reserve, Zunan Tunic, and Altun Ha. Visitors can also indulge in various adventure activities such as descending the black hole drop or wading through water-filled chambers in Aktun Tunichil Muknal Cave, which has an ancient Mayan sacrificial site. Moreover, you can bask in the sun on the picturesque beaches of Ambergris Cay and Cay Calker, which appear like a picture postcard. Belize offers visitors so many things to do that they are sure to yearn for a return visit even before their first one is over. Our list of the best things to do in Belize allows you to select your preferred adventure. No information is left out. Number 9. Ambergris Cay and Holchan Marine Reserve Ambergris Cay, situated near the tip of the Yucatan Peninsula, is the most extensive among over 400 Ks of Belize and is a popular destination for tourists. To indulge in activities like diving and snorkeling, one can visit the Hol Chan Marine Reserve, which consists of seven reserves within the Belize Barrier Reef System, the world's second largest reef after Australia's Great Barrier Reef. The reserve is named after the Mayan term for little cut and is known for fascinating features like a cut in the reef with steep coral walls, cat's eye, a crescent-shaped sinkhole, and shark ray alley, where divers can have an up-close encounter with nurse sharks and southern stingrays. San Pedro, the primary town of the island, is a vibrant fishing village with a mix of wooden homes, wandering dogs, and clucking fowl. In addition to water activities and sunbathing on the beach, popular pastimes in San Pedro consist of eating at charming cafes and visiting Belize Chocolate Company. While golf carts and bicycles are the usual means of transportation, there has been an increase in the number of cars and trucks cruising the sandy roads. Ambergris Cay is well known for its excellent fishing, particularly for bonefish, tarpon, permit, snook, and barracuda, which attracts saltwater fly fishing enthusiasts. Number 8. Placencia Peninsula Placencia is a well-liked beach resort and fishing village located at the tip of a 26 km long sandy peninsula. It is a preferred destination for tourists who want to enjoy the beautiful beaches of Belize, relish fresh seafood at fine dining restaurants, go fishing, as well as explore the lagoon by kayaking and indulge in diving and snorkeling activities at the Silk Cays Marine Reserve. The village is marked by vibrantly colored wooden houses that are elevated on stilts, a reminder of the fishermen who used to transport their catch on wheelbarrows along the narrow concrete path. Laughing Bird K National Park, situated close to Placencia, is another protected area of the Belize Barrier Reef Reserve System. Here, visitors can swim, snorkel, go sea kayaking, and dive, all of which are popular activities. On the Placencia Peninsula, the Seine Bight Village showcases the cultural heritage of Amerindians and Africans through traditional dance and drumming during frequent celebrations. Additionally, visitors can arrange a cruise through the mangroves of Monkey River from Placencia to witness crocodiles, howler monkeys, and birds. Number 7. K. Calker K. Calker is a favorite destination for budget travelers, backpackers, and those who enjoy a relaxed atmosphere. The island's sandy streets are perfect for sightseeing on golf carts or bicycles, where locals prefer playing reggae music and giving way to sleepy dogs. K. Calker located 24 kilometers south of Ambergris Cay, offers more affordable and rustic accommodations, with many visitors opting for the island's friendly guest houses. The Split, a small public beach, was created after Hurricane Hattie divided the island in 1961. The area north of the Split is quieter and less developed, attracting tourists who seek a total relaxation experience. 
It is unlikely to find flawless, smooth, sandy beaches, as the shoreline is mainly surrounded by turtle grass. However, there are areas with patches of white sand where visitors can sunbathe and enjoy the scenery of mangroves and coconut palms. The majority of tourists prefer to visit the barrier reef for water activities such as swimming, diving, and snorkeling. Additionally, popular activities on the island include kayaking, bird watching, and walking on the nature trails found in the K. Calker Mini Reserve. Number 6. Lamanai Archaeological Reserve. Situated on the banks of the New River in a verdant jungle, Lamanai is the most renowned archaeological location in the northern region of Belize and is also one of the most extensive ceremonial centers. The term submerged crocodile in one of the Mayan languages refers to Lamanai, and crocodile images have been found on excavated buildings, pottery, and figurines. The journey to the site is an adventure in itself, as a one-hour boat rides up the New River provides numerous opportunities to see wildlife. The dense jungle surrounding the ruins adds to the sense of adventure, and the site is still not entirely excavated. The Mayan site of Lamanai had the longest occupation period and was discovered by the Spanish in the 16th century. The churches in ruins show evidence of their efforts to convert the Maya people. The archaeological site includes over 900 structures and a museum displaying pottery, obsidian, figurines, and jade jewelry. Tourists can climb the high temple to enjoy a panoramic view of the surrounding jungle, along with other highlights such as the Mask Temple and the Temple of the Jaguar. Number 5. Mountain Pine Ridge Forest Reserve the Mountain Pine Ridge Forest Reserve serves as a refreshing contrast to the humid climate of the coast. The reserve's high altitude keeps the temperature pleasantly cool during the day and provides a much-needed break from mosquitoes. While hiking through the pine forests is a popular free activity in Belize, several trees have been destroyed by the pine beetle in recent years. The reserve offers various attractions such as rivers, waterfalls, pools, and caves. The Rio Frio Cave is a significant attraction in the reserve, which the Maya used as a burial ground in the past. The cave features stunning stalactite formations, freshwater pools, and waterfalls. The Five Sisters Falls feature five waterfalls that flow into a stunning pool, while the Rio On Pools offer small waterfalls that connect several pools made from granite boulders. These boulders are perfect for sunbathing after enjoying a swim. The Thousand Foot Falls, also known as Hidden Falls, are encircled by hiking trails and provide a great vantage point of the surrounding area from the observation deck. Number 4. The Belize Zoo If you're looking for a quick and easy way to view some of the fascinating wildlife in Belize, then you might want to consider visiting the Belize Zoo. Established in 1983, this attraction was initially founded to provide a home for wild animals featured in documentary films. The zoo is renowned for its focus on conservation and education, and is home to over 45 different native species, the majority of which are rescue animals. Visitors can observe a diverse range of animals in their natural habitat, including tapirs, toucans, howler monkeys, and spider monkeys. Additionally, the zoo boasts all five of Belize's wildcats, which includes jaguars, for big cat enthusiasts. The Belize Zoo is an excellent starting point for exploring Belize's wildlife and is a popular day trip destination from Belize City. Number 3. Altunha Archaeological Site Altunha is a well known ruin in Belize that can be easily accessed from Belize City. The name Altunha means rock stone pond or water of the rock, and it was a significant trading post, agricultural center, and ceremonial site in the Mayan civilization. The site has 13 structures and two main plazas, including the Temple of the Masonry Altars, which is the largest temple pyramid and the most important structure dating back to the early 7th century. From the top of the temple, visitors can enjoy stunning 360-degree views. The excavation of the Temple of the Green Tomb led to the discovery of the crypt of a Mayan priest king and various accompanying items such as pottery, pearls, jade pendants, and stingray spines used in Mayan bloodletting rituals. The Jade Head, a sculpted mask of the Mayan sun god, is another famous discovery made at Altun Ha and is the largest carved jade object found in the Mayan region. The Kana Pyramid, also known as Sky Palace, is a fascinating attraction at Caracol, standing at a height of 43 meters. 
It is the highest structure in Belize that has been built by humans and provides stunning views of the surrounding jungle and the site when viewed from the top. Number 2. Belize City, which was once a fishing village of the Mayan civilization, served as the capital of Belize until 1970 when it was severely affected by Hurricane Hattie. It is now the largest city and commercial center of the country and functions as a busy port that receives cruise ships and serves as the main gateway to Belize. Despite its worn-out appearance, the city has an interesting history that includes the Mayans, colonialism, hurricanes, and fires. The Museum of Belize, located in a former prison, is a great place to learn about the city's past. Old Belize, a museum, beach, and marina rolled into one, is also a popular tourist destination in Belize City. The attraction boasts an excellent restaurant that serves authentic Belizean cuisine. The Belize Swing Bridge was constructed in 1923 and serves as the sole manually operated bridge connecting the north and south areas of the city. Further away from the city, tourists can visit the Altunha Archaeological Site and the Belize Zoo. Located at the estuary of the Belize River, near the Caribbean coast, the city offers great fishing spots for anglers within a short drive from the city center. Number 1. Lighthouse Reef Atoll and the Blue Hole Lighthouse Reef Atoll is the furthest from the coast among the three atolls in Belize and is an ideal destination for those who appreciate nature and diving. The atoll features six Ks enclosing a blue lagoon with stunning white sand beaches, coconut trees, and captivating coral formations. The most popular attraction here is the Great Blue Hole, which is recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site and Natural Monument. The enormous marine sinkhole is so vast that it can be viewed from space. Visitors can swim in and witness the strange limestone stalactites protruding from the steep walls and possibly spot the resident group of reef sharks. Additionally, visitors can take a helicopter tour to have an aerial view of this natural wonder. The Half Moon K, which is a World Heritage Site, is the most popular K among the atoll. The Half Moon Kai Natural Monument is home to approximately 4,000 red-footed boobies and a variety of other birds. Visitors can take nature trails to observation platforms where they can see nesting boobies and frigate birds. In addition, tourists can visit the lighthouse and enjoy the stunning beaches on Half Moon Kai. Divers frequently visit the island for the excellent wall dives and the abundant marine life present in the area.